What do you do? Not present. Not present. What is that? Set up the Nintendo Switch. Yeah. And everything is safe. Yeah. Ooh, and Baba too can play. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so thank you. Thank you. Huggy, huggy. Yeah. And for Amma, <laughs> we'll do workouts. We'll play games and that together. Yeah. Baba to one set. What are you looking for? Why? Why are you looking for the scissors? This one? We got the Nintendo Switch Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Edition for the Black Friday offer. My three year old could not wait until <laughs> I would open it. So this is the bouncy ball. Yeah. And what is this? It's, it's a switch. Switch? It comes what? with a controller, what adapter, that? three months online membership for the Nintendo thing. Let's see what that will be. And switch console, the attachment for making a single controller, the blue one, Daddy, the red one, what you doing? and then hey, what you doing? Daddy is taking a video. I gave an HDMI cable. No, no, no. And the power what adapter, USB C, USB C power adapter, and a dock. And we have oh, that's the other other attachment for the controller, which goes on top of this. And, that. and then they'll have this one too, which will have a code for redeem, redeeming the digital version of the Mario Kart Deluxe 8 now connect it so one, this is the right side controller in one of the adapter you can just connect it like this maybe I got the wrong one in and it becomes a full-fledged controller for playing as a one person and then you press this and release it I believe So there is a lock. You just pull this and then push it back out. So it will come out. And then you also have this controller where you can attach this. And then this other one like this. And then it becomes a full joystick. And to release it, there is this button. You just press that button and then pull it up. And then you press this button and pull it up. So it comes up. And then you connect this to the screen. So this is the main switch console. And on this side. for this yet and then power button volume control and earphones and then you have a USB-C charger speakers simple one and this 
is the dock on which it will be going. We will be connecting this to the TV and it will be very easy to transfer from your handheld console to the TV. So there is a USB-C connector in there which you cannot see there. But setting just lightly done and then once you open this there's a USB and HDMI HDMI out and AC adapter just to place it you can get one of one more of these on Amazon for like 25 bucks with HDMI and you can use in different TV so you can take it from one room to another and then just uh, this is the power cable a USB-C we'll just connect it there HDMI cable is given long enough to reach the TV if you put it beside the TV so I've connected the USB-C and HDMI we brought it out of here and then I'm not sure what the USB port is for. Maybe it will I'll figure it out later. And something that I noticed is I think this doesn't have battery, so it will just use it will have its own internal battery which will get charged when you charge the console. So this gets charged, this gets charged. And when you disconnect it will work as individual controllers. I connected it to behind the TV, connected it to one of the non-free HDMI ports, it says you have to take it out and it is telling me to connect the controllers. I put the controller and it gave me a setup option, yeah, so it is giving me a setup option, it's to default behavior. A. Okay. America. Accept. Network connection. Connecting to the network. Connected. Time zone. Then it asks you to connect. Would you like to connect to a TV and play on a larger screen? Yes. Detach the Joy-Con controllers from the console. Do not press any additional button when detaching Joy-Con. That is the button to detach. It feels very stressful to remove that without pressing any other button but got it done now says use the left stick to select next press a on the right controller okay there is a kickstand oh okay mm -hmm. see you put it there so you can play like this and what do you do use the left stick Then press A on the next control. You will need the following the dark HDMI cable. No, no, we are doing with this. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Do with this one. Next, if you are plugged in the AC adapter, <laughs> done, done, done. Next, AC adapter to outlet and mount TV. Connect it to the dock, to the TV dock. Sorry, missed all that section. Connected to the dock. Now we can see, we can control stuff from here. User will be added to the console. There's Mario. Mm -hmm, that's Mario. Create a new user. 
What do you want? There is no Mario. Why is there no Mario? I, I want Luigi. You want Luigi? Yeah. Oh, okay. It wants. Hooray! Put an Nintendo account. Yeah, that's me. Then found it linked. Linked it with my account. Connect. Used a QR code to scan on my phone, and then it took me to the web page, and I logged in there, and it gave me an option to type the numbers that I see in my account. We got all of them now. Let's yes. get. And now, what's included? More Mario, games, more features. Mario and Luigi, that's my favorite. Yeah. That's my favorite too. Yes, that's Daddy's favorite and Boo's favorite. The Nintendo Switch Online service has old games, NES related games, smartphone stuff, so those kind of things. And parental control, yes. It asks me to install an app on my phone. I think that will give me control over who will be playing, when they will be playing. That's good. So the app had a nice UI. It let me uh, log in to my Nintendo account and it let me register on the TV. Now, continue set up on the smart device. It's done. The setup is complete. Press the home button. Button. Oh. So now, race page, range page, not this page. Each will have their own page. Insert game card, download software. Okay. Now it's all to us for exploring. I have to redeem the Mario Kart 8 and he, I think that will show up here and i bought a ring fit also that also i'll be probably that is a disc so i'll be probably inserting it into that and playing we'll be playing it so let the fun begin he's already enjoying the console no my son three year old without even giving him any training he's already playing stuff setting up his stuff even though he doesn't know what he's doing but he's having fun obviously system update so doing that he's connecting to the nintendo eShop mario kart 8 deluxe 59.99 and i got it so in the home screen actually they have an enter code option which is where you have to enter the code that they provide in your paper and then you will get the game. So you will once you enter the code you will see this and then you will just redeem it. Mario Kart has started. <laughs> He's having fun like crazy. 